Friday. So today, guys, it's going to be an amazing day. Hopefully, guys, we can find something great. If not, as always, we've been blessed and we've been blessed with a lot more. So, guys, let's get started with our dumpster diving adventure. All right, guys, we got some stuff. Look at all of this stuff that's right here in this container. Earphones and I don't know, just a bunch of stuff. iPod. There's so much stuff because the garbage trucks are going to be coming through today. Look at this. And this this basket came with a, a lid. So that's cool. We have stuff over here, too. Oh. Boyfriend and girlfriend. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get this basket, though. Because this is really nice. I like this. Look at this, guys. We have a few shoe racks that I'm taking. That's one. Here's another that I'm going to take. That's two. Definitely want those. Uh, what else is in here? Oh, Looks like some plaster. Really? Just gonna fall down like that on your girl? Sit up here. All right. Whoa, look at this guy. Oh no. This would have been cool if the leg wasn't broken. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That thing is huge. Let me see if the leg is in here somewhere. Possibly be fixed. No, but you got other stuff down in there. We have a little sword here. I see a bag of stuff here. You have a little helmet there, a little mask. Candyland game. Look at this, guys. The Candyland game, and the pieces are here. Cool. Can play that with my babies. Toys. Here we have Mario, a dinosaur head, a car there. I can use this bag actually. Put those pieces in there. Another little car here that could be donated. A little car here could be donated. Another car that could be donated little something little car somebody wanted another little car here that could be donated I guess this is the body one leg Take 
these bags out of here so I can really get this bag that's down here at the bottom. Oh, there it is, guys. Okay, that's the foot. Now let me see if I can find the leg. So that's the foot. Is this all I need? Let's see. No. And I think I need another piece. I think. Oh, no, I don't. No, look. I don't need another piece. Look. So I can just glue that on, right? I can just glue that on like that. And look at my baby. This is, a, I guess, a Tyrannosaurus. There we go. Look. Look. He's standing on his own. <laughs> How cool is that? All right, I'm going to leave you right there for a moment, buddy. Oh, look, we got this cool looking bat that a little boy may want. That's cool. We have this bag here that's sitting out here on the ground. And we have some personal information in here. Tax information. Yep credit card information they have the personal information here so i'm gonna go ahead and give them a call guys to let them know that i found this bag but it looks as if somebody got this bag probably stole all the contents and just put the bag on the side so i'm gonna go ahead and give them a call this is a toomey bag too guys and this bag is worth money okay look what we have here guys some rayvac lanterns let's see if they are working i guess we need some batteries of course but we have two of them. One, two. We're gonna take those. We have this Broadmoor story book. Still in the cellophane wrap. Never been used, never been opened. So we're gonna take that. What else is in here? bunch of straps okay we have more stuff in here guys we have this book let's see what kind of book this is it says to dad from joan with love wow look at this just a bunch of archived articles New York Times 1940 look 1926 she gave this to him in 1976 guys page one more events from the 1920 to the 19 to 1976 as presented in the New York Times oh wow look at that that's cool. All right, I'm gonna take this. Oh, it's called the page one. Oh, that's the name of it. Page one, major event of the 1920s to 1975 as presented in the New York Times. All right, so this is this is cool. Oh, uh, look at this, the New Yorker. The complete cartoons of New York. Look at that, it came with the CDs too. Look at this, guys. Oh my. Guys, we got so much stuff hiding in there. Look. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna take this too. All right, guys, I see some stuff in here. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my gloves so I can really get in like I want to. I got this stoop right here, so I gotta kinda step up on it. Look at that, guys. Look at this. Aren't those beautiful? Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh my gosh, look. Oh wow. The entire box is filled with goodies. This is a Made in India ODI. All right, we're gonna take the, the whole box. Okay guys, we are finally home and here's all the items that I was able to find today. Over here guys, we have two stands that I am going to use for my shoes. We also have these really cool books guys, The New Yorker here, as well as the One Page and the Broadmoor Storybook here. 
We also have up here, guys, a stethoscope as well as an Xbox microphone. Down here, guys, we have this Tumi bag that I found that did have some identification attached to it right here inside of this little pouch. And I am going to call the owner back today to let him or her know that I have it. Also, guys, we have this Targus leather iPod iPad case. Over here, guys, we have this Smart Nora. I got to open it to see whether or not the item is inside, but we will do that together. Over here, guys, we have a bunch of little toys that a little kid can use, and I'm sure he or she would love to play with them. Over here, guys, we have a complete Candyland board game right there that I will be keeping and playing with my children. Over here, we have some cool little stickers that I'm sure a little kid will love to have. And over here, guys, we have this complete box with these little gadgets in it I will have to do. Oh, it's Harry Potter. I just saw that down there. But this Harry Potter case right here, guys, with um, everything still inside. And then over there, we have some school supplies. Inside of this Yobi container, we have some color pencils and markers and pens. We have an empty... A two pocket portfolio with the prongs and over there we have a little book guys for a scientist in the making over here guys we have this whole foods hot or cold bag that would be great to use uh for church when i take the kids their lunches we can use that to keep our food either warm or cold over here guys we have two lanterns one of them is well actually they're both by ravok right here Right here, guys, we have some rope that could still be used. And then, guys, over here, we have a door bottom seal installation still in the cellophane, the wrapping, the cellophane wrap. Over here, guys, we have some belts, really, really cool belts by Urban Outfitters. Really cool belts here. We have some ballet slippers here. Over here, we have this really cool box, guys, that I thought was really pretty. It's a wooden box filled with a lot of uh, supplies that a handy woman can use. And then over here, guys, we have some toys for a child. I'm sure they would love to play bat and ball as well as, you know, uh, play cats and robbers with a sword here. And then, guys, over here. We have this box that we are going to go through together. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get ready to go in there. And let's see if this smart snore or smart Nora is still inside the box. All right. All right, here we go. So we have, I believe, yep, this is it. The smart Nora right there that goes here. See? See that? There we go. Of course, if I take out the charger. There we go, guys. See? Boom. So it is in here. Now, let's go ahead and go over here to this brown box. Let's see what all we have in here. Wasn't able to go to, through it earlier today. But look at this. I'm not sure what this is. But uh, it's there. We have these brass made in India mugs here. Really, really cool brass that my copper, not brass, I believe it's copper. And my husband absolutely loved uh, drinking out of these. So this is a score for sure. And we have more than one. We have one, two, three. Uh, move this stuff out of the way. Four. Let's see. Four of those. Look at that. That's cool. Look at that. It's a skull. That's so different. Oh my gosh. Look at that. That's really cool. We have this here. This is pretty. Look at that, guys. Look. This is a. Uh, Western Germany. This was made in Western Germany. 
It's empty. Looked like it was never used. This is cool. And then we have this sealed. Never been used. Never been opened. Still with the price tag on it, guys. Some Thai Cossack. Thai. Thai. Thai Usikit. Listen. Don't give me the line, okay? It's there. Whatever it is, it's still in the bottle. Look at that. I got to look that up and see how much that works. It's wine. And the um, indicator, you know, the safety seal is still on it. You don't see any rips or tears on the safety seal. And look, you can see the liquor right in there at the bottom. All right. Then we have these champagne flutes here. I want to be very gentle here, guys, because I don't want anything to break. We have this Packers green cup there as well as right here. Oh, look at that. That's really, really cool. I love this. These are called Joy Jolt. Look at that. We have this one. And we also have this one. I have to look those up and see how much those are worth. Cool. <laughs> Try to call back. Mom, huh? I okay, hold on. Hello. Yes, hi. Good morning. Can I speak to Yes, yes, hi. Hi, my name is Angel Williams. I'm calling you because did you lose or got a black Tumi bag stolen from you? They stole my car yesterday. Oh, they stole your car? Hold on for a minute. Okay, I have your bag. Um, I saw your, I found your bag when I was out. It was next to a garbage can. Um, it wasn't nothing inside. Now, it was a portfolio and constructions on it. You have some tax papers and things like that. Yes, I know. I know. I know. I know. Thank you very much. Can I come to pick it up? My husband will be home, um, and you can get it from him, but I won't okay, be in the you. area. Huh? Okay. And uh, uh, when I need to come outside of Chicago? Yes. Do you live in Chicago? Yeah, I live in Chicago, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I live in Chicago, but I won't be giving you the bag. My husband will. Okay. So when do you want to pick it up? I come in today. Okay. What 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 I need to come if, if in Chicago or not in Chicago? In Chicago. Ah, okay, perfect, perfect. Can you send me a message, please, to the address, and I I come in now. Okay, you want to come right now? Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, I'm gonna text you my address, and you can come right now. I'll have it waiting okay. for you. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much, man. You're welcome. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Bye-bye. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, guys. So I was able to get in contact with the bag owner. So he is on his way right now to pick it up. And I won't be able to deliver it to him because I got to go pick up Haley from school. But Antoine will definitely be here. And as you can see, I have the bag sitting right there uh, for him next to the garage. So when he come and pick it up, Antoine won't have to look all over the, the world for it. So I'm just super excited that I was able to find it. I know how it is when somebody violates you when they take your stuff. You feel so just helpless. You feel violated. You're angry. You go through so many different emotions. And if somebody just called to let you know that they found your possessions, it just makes you feel so much better. And um, I'm so glad that he had his information there. So it was easier for me to contact him to give him those things. So that was a blessing. Oh, he said not in Chicago. I got to text him back. All right, he's he's texting me right now. So let me go ahead and co finish communicating with the gentleman so he can come and pick up his bag successfully. All okay, right. guys, so the time now is 5.45 and I got, a con I got a message from the gentleman who wanted me to take his bag to the police station. And that's what my husband and I, uh, we're gonna do right now. You know, I can understand his hesitation for not, wanting to pick it up from my house um i get it we're gonna go ahead and take this bag as you can see it's still sitting 
right there. We're gonna go ahead and take it over to him right now. You ready? Yep. All right. Hi. I found this bag. I found this bag. It has some uh, contact information in it. I contact the owner. He asked me to bring it to the local police station. So that's what I'm doing. Okay. He didn't feel comfortable. He, I guess he'll come and pick it up. He didn't feel comfortable picking it up at the house. So. Sure. Did you tell him this season? I'm gonna let him know this station. What's yeah. this address? 3120 South Halstead. Uh, okay. Do you have his number? I do. Actually, you can look right here in this identification flap, and his name is. Oh, you just pick. Yeah, right there. And so he said uh, he'll pick it up. So I'll just let him know that. I think. Yeah, you can call. I'll stay right here. Hey, this is Officer Hurry. Department, how are you doing? Um, this uh, this nice lady brought your bath pick in, okay? So I'm just letting you know that we're at the, we're in the Ninth District at 3120 South Halstead. Okay, so can you come grab it? Are you close? Are you in the area? Yes, I'll say. Okay, so do you need um, do you need to write the address down? Okay, no problem. Okay, we'll see in a little bit. Thank you so much, no officer. You, you. you take Thanks care. No problem. All right, so that's done. It's dropped off. She contacted him and let him know that the bag was dropped off. Um, so he will have to come pick it up. He will have to bring identification. And my job is done. All right, guys. It's getting late. <laughs> I'm about to go in here and lay it down, lay it down. I love you guys.